News. It's been over a year now since the U.S. withdrew from Afghanistan, essentially ending the decades-long war. The historical event played out on TV, including here in our newscast, the thousands of people displaced, forced to seek refuge in the U.S., many of them settling in Northern California and our local towns. This morning, ABC 10's Marcus Allen tells us about one group of refugee students in Roseville, and they were welcomed how, Mark? Well, you know what, like I always say, and like my mom always said, and what Fred Rogers always said, in times of turmoil, when things are really bad, look towards those helping. And here's a great example of Roseville, California, Placer County, Wood Creek High School, and that exact same mission. Take a look. When the Taliban resumed control of Afghanistan, U.S. forces began what is now considered the largest airlift in human history. More than 76,000 Afghan refugees came to the U.S., many of them in our area. Fast forward to this sunny day a year later, a homecoming parade at Wood Creek High School, and a moment to recognize their own Afghan refugees. Lisa Edmiston, the coordinator and a 19-year veteran teacher at Wood Creek, says the support has been unprecedented. So we can't even begin to thank the Wood Creek community enough for their showing of support and love for these students at a really difficult time in their lives. I caught up with Habib, Hila, and Sundas, part of an on-campus organization to educate other students of their culture called the Afghan Social Club. Uh, it makes me very happy that my community is supporting refugees needing a place to go, needing a place to learn. They helped us a lot. We did um, an uh, Afghan donation drive where many people, students, teachers, and people around the community, they helped us a lot by like donating clothes, furniture, and everything that like helped a lot of refugees and some of our own families too that like that were like refugees. Did it make you happy when you came out in the parade and the students cheered you? They were happy for you. Uh, it made me feel happy and grateful for everything because they've been supporting us throughout hard times and also comforting us. And the people are so welcoming and so nice. They don't look at us as we're weird. They accept us as who we are and that has helped all of us. Man, hanging out with those kids yesterday really touched my heart. I mean, think about it. It's hard enough to be a teenager in this day and age at high school. Could you imagine you're a teenager and you're told, hey, gather what you can hold or put in a small bag, and tomorrow you're going to be on the other side of the earth, and that's all you're going to have. Uh, glad to know the people here in Roseville, California, Wood Creek High School doing the right thing, stepping up. Back to you. Yeah, setting the example. I mean, so often refugees from other countries are not welcomed, and in this case, more than welcomed. Mm -hmm. Okay, Marcus Allen. He found him, Wood Creek in Roseville. Mark, thank you.